Aloha, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. My name is Master Paul, coming to you live from the Ala Moana Beach Park here in Honolulu. Today is Wednesday. It is the third or fourth day, I believe the fourth day of January 2017. And it's going to be an excellent day. Today is day 17 of 21 days of healing ourselves through service to others. And when I was checking in this morning with who do we offer our service to, I received a couple of different responses, but the one that had the highest um, calling was to serve the children of humanity. And so <clears throat> for those that, that remain through this, through this uh, amazing hour of healing, we'll have an opportunity to serve humanity's children. And we will uh, offer this as part of our unconditional service in this 17 uh, 17th day of the 21 day challenge as for those also that are new who might watch us for the very first time there is a, a, a special event happening uh, Thursday the 12th at Master Shaw's Tao Healing Center which is an actual 21, 21 day challenge of healing uh, younger happier and healthier and so for all those that are joining me today and all those that might wish to understand a little bit more about that I encourage you to go to drsha.com to learn about Dr. Master Shah. So we have quite a few people jumping in here today. Welcome everybody. As indicated, today is the 17th day. So we have a few more days. This will actually, for us, technically will we'll end probably on a Friday since the, the 20 and 21st day is the weekend. And then when I come back on Monday, we'll start up again. Also want to give you a little forewarning that um, on the 17th of this month, uh, that will be my uh, last live stream day for a couple of weeks uh, because uh, all of the masters and many of the students are going to a special um, Dao retreat with Master Shah in Toronto area. <clears throat> and so I will be gone actually for 18 days. And uh, one of the universal students, Kristen, will be posting uh, pre previous live streams uh, that will cover everything from how to deal with fear, to how to release blockages in the heart center, all kinds of different uh, teachings that have done in previous live streams will be posted along with the flows. A lot of you really appreciate the flows that come through me when I offer uh, wisdom and teachings uh, from the divine, from, from different uh, spiritual mothers and fathers. And um, <clears throat> so she will post those flows along with the, the opportunity to click on that link. And for many of you, you might not be familiar with some of the previous live streams that I've done and not necessarily had the time to watch them. So that could be your substitute while I'm gone for those days. So I encourage you to stay with me uh, each day between now and the 17th when I take that uh, couple of week break and receive as many blessings as you can directly because when you're on with me live, uh, you can be interactive and a part of the healing. One of the beautiful things about the recorded live streams is <clears throat> all of the blessings that are offered during that live stream are just as effective. It doesn't matter if it's one or two or three years later, just as effective. And I'll give you a, a perfect example. Um, there's a local television station here called Olelo, and it's a, it's a Hawaii-based television station. And I have um, offered a, a, a half-hour show on that for four years now. And so one day I offered a... Um, Divine Healing Hands Blessing was at the end of the show and the show was recorded. That means it will not actually air to the general public for almost 30 days. And um, so I offered uh, a Divine Healing Hands Blessing. This was before I was a, a Divine Channel Vehicle and Servant. And this I, I just told the, the, uh, the invisible audience because there was really no audience. I said, choose whatever you want a blessing for. Tell the Divine I will uh, offer this blessing for three minutes. And, um, and, you know, blessings to you. And so anyway, about, uh, about almost two months after the show aired, a woman had shown up at Master Shaw's Dow Healing Center and she said, I recognize you. You're the person, you're the reason why I'm here. I remember that show where you offered a blessing, which I completely forgot about it. And she said, I asked for uh, pain in my foot, which I had had for four months. And she said, the pain went away and it's still gone. And that's the reason I'm here. And so... It matters not when the blessing is offered. If it's recorded, you can uh, receive that blessing again. So I encourage you to always remember that, uh, not only for, for any of the wisdom and teachings that I offer through my live streams, 
but also Dr. Master Shah has a lot of YouTube videos for specific body parts, organs, systems, and um, he has the, the highest healing is at, is at uh, the videos on demand, uh, VOD, videos on demand, VOD uh, dot drshaw.com. Those are awesome. Well, anyway, let me acknowledge all those who have jumped in here to join me today. <coughs> welcome CJ, welcome Nikki, good to see you yesterday and today. Welcome Sherry, welcome back. Welcome Judas, welcome Tammy, and um, Ali, good to see you Ali. Hi Dove, Dove's coming in from the big island of Hawaii. And then welcome Michelle, haven't seen you in a while, good to see you back here. Welcome Sherry, and welcome Teresa, and Zilke. Welcome Lori, welcome Kristen Rojas, welcome Yvonne. I got your messages Yvonne, I sent a text back. Congratulations on those major shifts in your life. Um, welcome Petra, and Yvonne if you want you can even uh, write something because I'm going to be asking people to comment on the benefits of these uh, of these days that you've been focusing on releasing certain blockages in your life. And uh, in Yvonne's case, she's seen a lot of shift around family and relationship, um, but she probably was asking for uh, issues with her spine and spinal column. But it could very well be that these issues with the spine and spinal column have a connectivity to relationship. Uh, welcome Petra, welcome Samantha Brooks. And let's see, welcome Petra and Dana and welcome Ilona, welcome Stephanie and welcome Delma. Anyone else who I haven't acknowledged, I love you. Please forgive me for not acknowledging you. I haven't seen your name pop up. So let us go ahead and connect heart to heart, soul to soul, placing our hands in soul light, soul service, hand position, which is dropping our left hand in front of our heart center and our right hand gently pointed up towards heaven. We're going to fully connect. Welcome, Pat. Good to see you. Close your eyes. I hope you enjoy the Hawaii view behind me. I'm at the park here called Ala Moana Park. But you'll have to look at that after you come back from closing your eyes. So let us fully connect. Dear all layers of the divine, all layers of the Tao, all layers of the source. All beings of light serving the plan of the light side, dear the soul of all masters, ascended masters, lamas, sifus, gurus, saints, angels, healing angels, archangels, dear the soul of all the light side planets, stars, galaxies, and universes. We love you, we honor you, deeply appreciate you. We ask at this time for you to please join us to come to sit in each of our heart centers. Bless us to release all of our blockages, specifically the ones that we have been focusing on for these 21 days. Please bless all of the souls that we chant for. Today we will be chanting for the children of humanity. And we ask that as we do our forgiveness practice, we ask that any of the children that we or our ancestors have harmed in this lifetime and any lifetime, that they please come forth and receive our forgiveness. We invite all of the light beings that have come to please assist in this practice in the highest and best and most appropriate way. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Dear the Source Soul Song of Love, Peace and Harmony transmitted to all souls in all universes, we love you, honor you, appreciate you. We invite you to turn on and as we chant love, peace and harmony, we ask that you please connect our hearts and souls together. Bless us to be more value on show ye, more one in our thoughts, words, and actions. <clears throat> so let us chant for a few minutes to fully connect. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula. O ai, wo xin er ling, o ai tran ran lei. Wang li hing rong er mu shi shang, 
双爱平安而行，双爱平安而行。I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula, lula, ha, li. Thank you, thank you, thank you. For anyone that will be watching this recording in the future, they're wondering what that song is and how they can hear it again. Uh, Kristen has posted in the chat boxes the the words, the uh, the MP3 download, which is a free download, uh, and um, additional information on the uh, 28 plus languages that it is currently sung in and around the world. So thank you all for joining. I see Ben's joined us. Welcome Ben. Welcome Kristen Strachan. Welcome Tawana and Jenny Brown. And um, welcome, Monica. Thank you all for joining. Welcome, Pamela. Welcome, Angel. And uh, so I see uh, Ari's joined us as well. <clears throat> so today we're going to be focused on serving the children of humanity. As we focus on chanting for them, we will also ask the aspects of our specific chosen area. That we have、uh, been trying to clear blockages in for these 21 days to chant on our behalf for the children. Now,、um, one of the students、uh, had、uh, left me a couple messages earlier today, saying that she had noticed significant shifts in、uh, her relationship with family members, and、uh, she may or may not be noticing significant shifts with her spine, which has been a long-standing problem for her. And but it could be curious to find out if in fact、uh, her spine pain is decreasing, and analogously with the、uh, improvement of the relationships. Oftentimes, emotional blockages impact us in physical ways, and this is a possibility here. Might be no correlation whatsoever, but it also may be a possibility. And so I encourage you to also pay attention to these areas. <clears throat> if you have, let's say, a pain in the neck. Who in your world is the pain in the neck、uh, that you have to deal with, that you haven't forgiven, that you haven't worked through your blockages with? If you have、uh, migraines,、um, who, in, who in the world is creating problems、uh, in your thinking processes in your head?、Uh, where do you have the greatest problem staying focused? You might find that there's a correlation there, and so just、uh, something to consider. But in dealing with、um, This basic understanding, this basic teaching of serving others, we, we, the most important thing is to do it unconditionally. Of course, we want to see results for ourselves, but at the same time, it is when we completely forget about ourselves is when the greatest healing occurs.、And、this is a, a one-sentence secret. So we do our best. So, by the way, thank you all for hitting the share button to let others know about this. Let us go ahead and prepare <coughs> for、uh, this. Chanting in this service for the children, 
we're going to do a forgiveness. Yes, I see. I saw that earlier, Angel. So you're going to want to ask all the souls of your lower back uh, where you have this excruciating pain uh, and your abdominal muscles because that's often associated with it as well as your hip. Uh, ask all of these souls that are bringing this suffering to you to forgive you and then ask, uh, ask every soul to chant from this sore area on your behalf for the children. So let us do a forgiveness practice with all of the children from this and all lifetimes that we have direct association with and then we will chant for the other children of this world. Let us do this together. Placing our hands in soul light, soul service, hand position. And then repeat after me if you feel comfortable and appropriate. Dear the soul of my children, from this lifetime, from all time, I love you. I truly, truly love you. You are a big and very important light in my life. Without you, I would not have the wisdom and the great education, the great opportunity to open my heart so much more. Without you, I would not have the many, many opportunities for growth that you have allowed me to experience. I sincerely ask for forgiveness for bringing to you any thoughts or words or actions, any wrong teachings, anything that I have ever done to you in this or any time that has caused you to suffer physically, emotionally. If, any, if I have said anything that has caused you to have any form of unpleasant emotion, such as depression or anxiety or fear, if I have brought thoughts, words, or actions to you that has caused you to have worry, sadness, or grief, any other unpleasant emotions, I deeply and sincerely, sincerely apologize. If any of my thoughts, words, or actions have caused you to not fully have an open heart, if my thoughts, words, or actions have caused you to question love, to question a uh, creator, to question your oneness with everything, if my thoughts, words, or actions have caused you to fall off of or go away from a spiritual path that is highest and best for you, I wish to deeply and sincerely apologize. I know it is entirely possible that I have been a less than perfect parent to you, and I wish to apologize for this as well. I wish to offer my greatest request for forgiveness. And if, in fact, you have come to me to remind me through bringing suffering to me as your parent, then I wish to offer you my unconditional forgiveness. Please forgive me if in this or any lifetime I have harmed you. And I offer you my unconditional forgiveness if in this or any lifetime you have brought harm or suffering to me. Let us chant together, my beloved children, for other children of humanity. And now we will connect with all of the souls. Continue to repeat, dear the divine Tao and Source, dear all beings of light, I love you. I invite you to chant along with us at this time to serve the children of humanity. Dear my own soul and all the souls in my body, especially the souls of my condition, state your condition. And for those that are on the 21 day challenge, state the one you've been choosing. For those that are newer, state whatever your major challenge area is. It has a soul. We ask you to please chant to serve others, chant to serve the children of humanity. They're very, very grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And so as we chant to serve the children of humanity, visualize the children being nourished, receiving divine light and the divine's love, receiving the food or nourishment they may need, receiving the shelter they may need, receiving the love from a parent or a loved one that they might be greatly lacking 
So visualize the children of the world receiving all of those things that they need to be the best and highest light. They are our future. Without those children that are coming into an adult stage, without them being of pure heart and pure light, we will not have a very bright future. So we want to serve them as much as possible. So let us chant now love, peace, and harmony. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Those that have just joined us, we're chanting love, peace, and harmony to serve the children of this world. The words can be found in the chat if you scroll back through the chat. Let us continue. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. <coughs> lula, lula, li. all of the children being surrounded by golden orbs of light surrounding all of the children of the world nourishing them feeding them bringing them what they need most heaven knows we just serve lula lula li lula I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. 
<coughs> join hearts and souls together love peace and harmony love peace and harmony continue to chant silently or out loud and I will offer a third eye and a flow as to what is happening at this time how at this time there are many cherubs baby angels that have come there is a realm in heaven where all of the children go to as part of the staging grounds for when they return to heaven and these children are prepared they are nurtured they are blessed with some of the highest frequencies and these cherubs come from this realm and they have come to all of the children of earth there are quite a few that will be leaving soon as an aspect of their soul journey and with this calling they are being prepared so that the process of transformation is nominal and of greatest benefits there are quite a few whose lives are being saved at this time they are receiving heaven's nectar heaven's vitamins minerals nutrients proteins and all that is needed to sustain their health and well-being some are having virus and bacteria minimized and or nullified in their systems the additional light that is being offered by the trillions upon trillions of holy beings that are offering their blessings at this time continues to heal and transform some of the karmic blockages that have created the various sufferings in some of the children especially those in what is termed third world countries this light is being all the children but the effect is different for the children in these uh, most destitute of countries they are receiving clearing of the karmic conditions that would hold them in this pattern giving them the opportunity to rise up and out of these conditions in this lifetime for others it is messages of how to be that what they were intended to be in terms of their love and light for this coming human shift there are still others who are receiving blessings to fully awaken their entire spiritual awareness they are known as the star children those who have the highest frequencies highest and best karma and highest awarenesses those uh, children are receiving blessings to more fully awaken them this blessing is also not limited to humanity's children it is also affecting those that are in the womb of the mothers throughout the world those children that are not born yet there are lives that are being saved through this process as some of the mothers are not in the uh, appropriate condition to have a full term birth there are some in the womb that were scheduled to come early and with the blessings they are receiving they will come more to correct term there are uh, all of the children are receiving blessings for intelligence enlightenment and reminding them of the necessity of their mission in coming in to humanity at this time there is tremendous blessings being offered from all realms of all light beings for the children especially and specifically because of the very very important role that they play for humanity at this time we are honored to chant with you let us continue Lula, 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 
la li lu la le la li lu la le la li lu la wo ai wo xin er li wo ai chuan ran le wo li hing rong er mu shi shong shong ai ping on a xie shong ai ping on a xie i love my heart and soul i love all humanity join hearts and souls together love peace and harmony love peace and harmony la lu la li lu la lu la la li lu la lu la li lu la lu la li lu la lu la li lu la oi wo xin er ling oi chuan ran le on li ying rong er mu shi shong shong ai ping on a xie shong ai ping on a xie I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace. and harmony and for those that have just joined us we're chanting to serve the children of humanity so visualize the blessings radiating out to them lu la lu la li lu la lu la la li lu la lu la li lu la lu la li lu la lu la li lu la wo ai wo xin er ling wo ai chuan ran le wo li ying rong er mu shi shong Shong ai ping on he xie Shong ai ping on he xie I love my heart and soul I love all humanity Join hearts and souls together love peace and harmony <coughs> love peace and harmony one more round lu la lu la li lu la lu la la li lu la lu la li lu la lu la li lu la lu la li lu la wo ai wo xin er ling wo ai chuan ran lei wang li ying rong 
而不是生，生爱平安和谐，生爱平安和谐。I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. 好，好，好 ，Thank you, Thank you, Thank you. <coughs> wow, very powerful. I was amazed at what was happening when I did the soul reading and and can see the soul images. Heaven was very moved. Heaven, heaven came. Trillions upon trillions of holy beings, layers of heaven came, serving the children of humanity, and even the children in the wombs were being served. Because heaven knows how very important the children are to the future of the human race, it's not just a, a, a blanket statement. Humanity has significant, significant problems right now. There is huge darkness on on the surface of humanity, but there is massive, massive movements of light as well, and light exposes darkness. And what happens when darkness is exposed is it fights back. It doesn't like to be exposed. It doesn't like to be seen. Doesn't like to be known. It likes to do everything under the covers, so no one really knows that it's manipulating. But darkness is being exposed left and right. And that's because of all the light that has come to the planet. The children are our greatest light beings. The adults, we have to work hard to maintain our light because we have had a lot of programming from、uh, all of our lives and this life, and we're busy unwinding all the karmic blockages, etc. The children are extremely important to us, so please share any of your third eye, any of your insights, and then、uh, I, I recommend each of you stick around because、uh, after we connect with some of the sharing, then we're going to do a group divine healing hands blessing. I will ask all the divine healing hands healers that are present on the line to turn on their treasure, and we'll offer a couple minute blessing to everybody for a particular condition that they might have. I saw、um, one sharing. It was kind of kind of amusing. Samantha says、uh, this has been on her mind for days, and her kids just woke up, but the chanting、uh, served her children in bringing them back to sleep. So welcome, Amir. Glad you could join us. I hope you're able to go back and watch the whole、uh, recording, as it was a great service to the children of humanity.、Um, welcome. To everyone else that jumped in that I haven't acknowledged, welcome Amy and Angie, welcome Anna Fana, and Sarah MacArthur, welcome Loveness, and welcome Olivia and Lopez. <clears throat> so please、uh, offer your sharing of how this experience might have been for you. Any aha moments as well.、Uh, welcome Jennifer Kara Smith, and thank you for sharing as well.、Um, so any aha moments that you might have had. As a result of this blessing, one of the things that、um, that I have been considering for a couple of years、uh, is, you know, will I have children? I got married and have to get the certain ducks in a row, and、um, so you know, there's a lot of responsibilities that come with them. And one of those greatest ones is keeping the children in the light,、uh, ensuring that they are not tarnished by our wrong teachings, by、um, by our wrong spiritual guidance. By our、uh, patterns that we bring into this world through our karmic blockages, so it's very important, very, very important to do forgiveness practice with your children all the time, not only the, the ch children from this lifetime, but in all lifetimes. <clears throat> Because if you are someone that that follows the belief system that we go around more than once, then there's a very distinct possibility that our children were our parents and vice versa. Our brothers and sisters could have also been our parents and/or children. And so, whoever we have blockages, invariably there's a, a connection there. <coughs> so I'm going to read some of the comments.、Uh, CJ says, "Very beautiful. 
saw all the kids smiling and enjoying playing the water, grass, air, forming a circle. And God is in the middle, blessing them. Grateful for that. Thank you. Beautiful visions. Thank you for your sharing, CJ. And then Nikki says she had her niece and nephew who were both um, released from this plane uh, in an accident and a couple of children who were friends of hers who had passed on come and give hugs all around her. Wonderful. Yeah, see those children, <coughs> just because they leave the earth plane does not mean that, that they are still not the pure beings of light that they have always been. So it's wonderful that you were able to experience that. And then welcome Kathy Berger. So <clears throat> for those who are divine healing hands healers, we're going to ask you to offer your service at this time. <clears throat> and so uh, I know there's at least uh, probably 10 healers that are divine healing hands healers. So all of us are very, very blessed to have 10 divine healing hands healers offering a blessing. That's a very, very, very big blessing. So. Um, close your eyes, make a request to the divine for one uh, organ, just one, one organ or system. System means like a cardiovascular system, endocrine system, etc. Or a condition. Condition is like a migraine or diabetes, something like that. Organ system or condition. Make one request at this time that includes the healers. You can also request something like, that's an emotional based blockage. You know, feeling depressed, feeling anxious, etc. Stress. You can make an emotional based request. <clears throat> but try to keep it to those. Again, only request one. All the divine healing hands healers, please turn on your healing transmission. Go through your process of request with your healing transmission. Make sure you state uh, as appropriate on the healing blessing. And we ask our Divine Healing Hands Healer Transmission to please turn on. As appropriate, please offer a blessing to all those that are watching on this live stream. We ask that it go to the one area of request, that if there is more than one area of request, that you only offer a blessing for one. We are grateful to Divine Tao and Source and to Master Shah for the opportunity to serve with our Divine Healing Hands. This blessing is for three minutes. Blessing begin. Let us chant love, peace and harmony. For Everybody is receiving, even those that have offered a blessing, you can make your request. Let us chant love, peace and harmony. For those that are receiving, focus on golden light in the area of request. If it's not a physical thing, focus on your heart center. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Oh, I wash in her ling. Oh, I trod randly. Wong ling rung her musher shong. Shong I ping on her she. Shong I ping on her she. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. 
Lula, Lula, I was in Berlin. I turned red, lonely hero, a butcher shop, so I pick on a ship, so I pick on. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Last minute. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula, lula, li, lula. Oh, I wash in her ling. Oh, I run, run, lay. Only in room, her. I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Ha ha ha! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Divine Healing Hands Healers, please ask your treasure to return. We thank Divine, we thank the Tao, we thank the Source for this opportunity to serve with such an incredible, incredible healing treasure. Uh, for those that are interested in becoming a Divine Healing Hands Healer, there is a workshop in Honolulu the last week in February, and it is an extraordinary healing treasure. It will save you a ton of money with your own health, with loved ones' health, children's health, uh, parents' health, uh, because it works on just about everything. Uh, and you just don't have to go to the, do the doctor near as often. Of course, for you know the common colds and flus, it cuts those in half, but most of us still have to process through that kind of stuff. But it works on amazingly on so many things. And of course, uh, you are empowered to serve others. The reason Divine Healing Hands has been brought to humanity at this time as an actual transmission, you receive it as a transmission, and then it's yours permanently on your soul through all your lifetimes, you can wake up as a baby next lifetime and be an instant healer. Um, when you receive this, you literally uh, are be, can be a much better servant to humanity. And if there are very difficult times at some point in the future, um, then you can use it to bless others that might be going through some very difficult conditions. So there's reasons for this most amazing healing transmission to have been brought to humanity at this time. And you know, one of the beautiful things about it, I just mentioned it to you just so you're aware, the honor fee for it, I think is exceptionally small. It's a one-time fee of about $700. And then it's yours forever. Most people can earn 50 to 100 bucks just with one or two blessings because people spend that much on a massage, it doesn't work. So, uh, you know, start saving for it if that's something of interest to you. Please share, how was that feeling for you? Uh, how was that experience? Did you have pain or something that was measurable? And has it reduced from that blessing? There was at least 10 of us that turned on our healing transmissions because I know as seeing the names through the scroll uh, who has this transmission. Um, so please share what your experiences were. And then I see a couple of acknowledgments and thank yous. Uh, Loveness says, it's an honor to serve. Thank you, Loveness. And Loveness has a uh, 
love this. I, I mentioned this the other day, but I don't know if you posted. Um, when are you doing your La Peace Harmony chanting? Uh, she has an amazing uh, dot eye calligraphy, one of the highest calligraphies on the planet today. And uh, I would highly recommend you get a calligraphy blessing from her. You should not charge less than $100 for that lot, uh, loveness. It's, a, it's an amazing, amazing uh, treasure for, um, for anyone to receive a blessing from that calligraphy. Um, let's see. So Angie says she wants to be a healer. When it'll, it'll happen when it's meant to happen. Zilke, uh, I love Divine Healing Hands. I'm very grateful to have um, received them. So thank you, Zilke, for your service today. Joanne, hopefully your head's not so heavy after this blessing. Nikki says, thank you very much. Uh, Anna says, Aloha, Master Trevor. Thank you for the beautiful Divine Healing Hands blessing. Um, so I, I'm Master Paul, but I, but I appreciate the, the uh, comment. Master Trevor is just a little cuter than me and has this funny Australian accent. Um, welcome, Kathy. Heart feels lighter. Thank you so very much. You're very welcome. Uh, Archana's joined us. Welcome, Archana. Michelle says, thank you, Paul. Love listening to uh, the chanting. Very good. And Joanne says she saw the gold light, uh, but further on it and turned to a red color. Okay. Monica, deepest gratitude for all those that served. Monica's a Divine Healing Hands healer. CJ says, thank you for the blessings. Really helped me a lot. And uh, she can feel the presence of the Divine. Yeah. It's called Divine Healing Hands for a reason. The Divine comes through, offers amazing blessings. Uh, Samantha says, Awaking pains that, that have been told and felt by to me. I picked the stomach and just connected with it. Would love uh, to be a healer. Great. Um, learn more about the Divine Healing Hands. Sarah MacArthur says, Had heaviness in the heart, released lots of tears, thought of her mother and daughter who both passed within the last five years. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Wonderful, excellent sharing. So happy that we could serve so many souls. So join me tomorrow, day 18 of the 21 days. And a reminder for all those that uh, Master Shah's Tao Healing Center, um, tonight, uh, tonight, no, tomorrow night, the 5th and the 12th, tonight is a preliminary uh, opening to the actual Younger, Happier, Healthier 21 Day Challenge. There's $1,000 in grand prizes. It's almost free to join. It's a small honor for you to join, but you get huge support. And then um, it can be done in person or in webcast. And then Thursday, the 12th, is when they actually release it. So, so do uh, register to watch that on live stream on Thursday night, 6 to 9 p.m. Hawaii time. Uh, and so adjust your time accordingly. And so you can uh, text me if you need any more information. Kristen has been posting the links uh, throughout, so you can also find it that way. And Sherry says she saw the blockages in her heart scattering. Thank you, the wrist not hurting as much, says Tawana. Crystal says the blessings were so powerful she was knocked out and kept coming in and out. Very grateful. Um, Kristen Strachan says, ask for the thumb joints, not sure, but seems less painful. Good. So please uh, share if you haven't already. If you're new, please hit the subscribe button. You'll know when I come live. Love you, love you, love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Divine Tao and Source, all the beings of light who have come. Thank you to our Divine Healing Hands Healer Soul. Thank you to all of you who offered your unconditional service today to the children of humanity. Huge blessings to you for your unconditional service. Thank you, everyone. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.